What happened to you, Miss Pepper? What? Are you dead? No way! So in this video, let's talk about why do we need to do a water change. For those who don't know what is nitrogen cycle, you can watch my other video which I explain what is nitrogen cycle. This nitrogen cycle is really important in this topic. Basically, there are three things that you need to monitor. You need to know what is ammonia, nitrate, and nitrite. Let me explain what is nitrogen cycle in the passes way. First, you're gonna feed your goldfish and your goldfish gonna poop and that poop is an ammonia. Ammonia is toxic for your goldfish, so you want that to be detoxified. Our nature have a two good bacteria. Let's talk about the first bacteria. That good bacteria eat up ammonia and then when they eat up ammonia, they release nitrate. And that nitrate is more toxic than ammonia, so you want that nitrate to be detoxified. Again, there's a good bacteria that will eat that nitrate and release nitrite. That nitrate is less toxic for your goldfish. Yes, it is less toxic, but still, it is toxic for your goldfish. This is the reason why we do water change, to lower the level of nitrate. You can also use some plants because plants consume nitrate, like what I have on my filter. Now that I already explained what is nitrogen cycle, the next question is, when do you need to do a water change? We need to consider a lot of things before we can answer this. One of those is, how many times do you feed your goldfish? Do you over filter your tank or you under filter your tank? Do you have a lot of leftover pellets? Those are the things you need to consider. Just for example, here in my main tank, I have a 4 breeder size and I feed them around 6 to 8 times a day. Just enough pellet, pellets that they can finish in less than a minute. I also have this A3000. By the way guys, if you haven't buy a filter, I highly suggest to buy a filter with 5 times flow rate. Just for example, I have this 75 gallon tank and the flow rate of my filter is 3000 liters per hour to convert my 75 gallon is around 280 to 300 liters so the flow rate of my filter is 10 times every hour the water runs through my filter 10 times in an hour in short this tank is over filtered plus i have two more sponge filter so i have a really over filtered tank is that bad no because it detoxify more ammonia and nitrate so i highly suggest to buy a filter with flow rate of four times or five times or more in order to keep your goldfish from ammonia and nitrate just an additional information even if you have 10 times 20 times 30 times flow rate and you don't have enough housing or substrate for the good bacteria to live on it is nonsense because the purpose of flow rate is to make the water flows in the housing of the good bacteria which where detoxification happens now that you know the reason why you need to do a water change and when to do a water change you can now like this video and wow. subscribe to my channel if you already know me i do a water change and metal in salt bath every Saturday. In this tub, I just put one tablespoon of aquarium salt and one teaspoon of metalin. Before I put them in the tub, I check their scale if there's some redness or any issues. Look at this one. What? That's so chunky. And I put him into the tub. And look at this one, guys. What? Oh my god, that's so beautiful. Oh, oh, what? I'm gonna keep those two. Alright, gonna keep you guys. And let's get Miss Peppa. Oh, do not run, baby. This good for you. Alright. Okay. Ooh, you're so big. Oops. Let's go, let's go. Let me put you on the tab. Alright. Okay. We'll soak them for around 5-10 minutes. Scrub, scrub, scrub! And right now, I return Miss Pepper because if you don't know guys, 
Miss Pepper is really dramatic. This is why I don't like putting Miss Pepper into a methylene salt bath. Look at what? She is too dramatic. I just put him here in just less than four minutes, guys. Less than four minutes. And look at what? By the way, the other goldfish are all pine, except from Miss Pepper. Anyway, I don't worry about this because it happens to me every time I do a methylene salt bed. And I just do this and then later on, she will be fine. And look at her. She swims. She's okay. She doesn't want a methylene salt bed. Which good for her. It's really hard to be a goldfish parent. After that, I prepare a methylene salt bath from Wing Tang. Same as before, I put a 1 tablespoon of aquarium salt and 1 teaspoon of methylene salt bath. And at the same time, I do a water change on their tongue. Let's put this guy this. This part of it. First. It's really hard. Okay. Okay. But first, let's see. Oh, let's do it. Right. Which one is that? Surface. Look at that. Look how big I am. Here. Let's go in the first. How about you guys? Who wants to eat? You are so dramatic, girl. You are so dramatic. Get up, guys. Get up. Go big. Go big.